Hello everybody, my name is Chris Ponsalan. Welcome to another video. And yes, my grandmother and I went viral on TikTok. So if you've been subscribed to my channel for a while, then you've probably seen videos of my grandmother. I am my grandmother's full-time caretaker. I've been taking care of her for three years and I've been documenting my life with her for as long as I can remember. I decided to film a day in the life with my grandmother and post it on TikTok because I wanted people to see what caretakers go through um, and just to share what my life is like taking care of my grandmother. I had no idea it was gonna go viral. Uh, I thought it was just gonna get 10 likes as my videos were usually getting. And yeah, I was just gonna keep it moving. So I posted it at like seven in the morning, uh, put my phone down, went about my day, and I checked my TikTok again around 9 a.m. And the video, it just, it was, it, it went viral. It had a million views. I gained like 11,000 followers and I was like, what the f is going on? I was so confused and overwhelmed with all of the nice comments. I went live on TikTok and there were like 600 people on the live and that's the most amount of people I've ever had on a live broadcast. I was getting tons of emails and tons of direct messages from people telling me that I made their day or I reminded them of their grandparents and people were just being really kind. And yeah, it sort of just kept going up from there. Somebody posted it on Twitter and that video went viral. Other people posted it on Instagram and those videos went viral. I saw myself on Reddit. LAD Bible wrote a story about me on their page and it was just madness. And the video is currently at like, I don't know, 19 million views, which is an insane amount. And I think the most humbling thing of all was that in the midst of everything, all the new followers, all the emails, all the DMs, just everything, I would go downstairs to my grandmother's room and I would do our regular routine. I would help her get up, I would feed her, I would scratch her back. I would just, I would do everything that I would normally do and nothing was, nothing was different about it. My grandma was still the same grandma. Everything in my house was still the same. Nothing changed. And I like that. So yeah, I don't know. I kind of just wanted to tell that story and to let everyone know that if you're looking to make a viral video and you're trying to achieve a, a certain level of happiness from that viral video, I don't think anything is going to come from that. Sure, maybe you'll get that excitement from getting all those new followers and getting DMs and emails or whatever. But for me, all of that stuff quickly went away. I still have to put in work to promote my music. I still have to put in work to... Uh, keep this YouTube channel running. I still have to put in work in taking care of my grandmother and the viral video didn't change anything other than my follower count. But I don't want you to take that the wrong way. I think it's cool that it happened. Uh, I really, really appreciate all of the kind words. There are a lot of really nice people on the internet and it's really nice to see that. And to everybody that was thinking that it was weird that I would go and set up my camera and then go back to helping my grandmother to show everybody I was doing a good deed or that I shouldn't be showing things like this because these type of things shouldn't be documented. Listen, I get it. If that was your first video of mine that you were seeing, I can understand how you would think that I'm using my grandmother for views. Um, I get it. I, I, I completely understand where you're coming from, but that's not the case at all. Documenting my life is what I enjoy doing. Um, I did it before I started taking care of my grandmother and I will continue to do so for the rest of my life. And um, yeah, thank you to everybody that was here before I went viral on the internet. And thank you to all the new people. I appreciate you. And yeah, that's all I got to say. I love you guys. Thanks for sticking around. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Demons at my side trying to get me, get me. Put them on my back just to save you. If I spill out everything, will you get it, get it? Never ended well when I made you.